What if Charles Darwin had sailed with Napoleon to Egypt in 1798 instead of boarding the Beagle 30 years later? While French cannons thundered across Cairo, Darwin would have been collecting specimens along the Nile, ancient tombs filled with mummified animals, hieroglyphs showing extinct creatures, and living species unlike anything in Europe. Surrounded by evidence of life changing over thousands of years, he would have cracked the code of evolution three decades early. But this time he'd be writing in French. Napoleon's scientists would have dominated biology instead of British naturalists. The Catholic Church would have faced evolutionary theory during Napoleon's anti-religious campaigns, not Victorian England's polite debates. French would have become the language of modern science. Darwin's insights would have fueled Napoleon's vision of rational empire building across three continents. Scientific progress accelerated by an entire generation. One different voyage could have changed who controlled the future of human knowledge.